So the last video about swing was kind of cool. And you guys on YouTube, if you want to see more or probably have it for yourself, you can buy the DVDs or buy the download. Or you can just join Sample Kings and see our streaming lessons. They're 24 hours a day. It's not that expensive to join, just like 20 bucks a month for five months for one year. Or you can pay 80 bucks and be in for a full year and we'll also give you 76,000 samples just for paying the 80 bucks and joining for one full year. So look, in this lesson, I want to talk about layering. I like to layer sounds out. Now, the last lesson, I still have the same beat here. Let's look at this. Uh... Okay, we see here A1, we've got two kick drums here, right? And I'll play it from here. That's it. Let's go here. We're going to go that little button right there. That's the program edit right there. And now we're in program edit. You'll see here in the layers, we can add four different layers to a drum. And we have our volumes here, fine tuning and just start tuning. As you can see right here, right? So I want to go here and probably add a drum. Now, one of my pet peeves, too, I, I don't know the drum. I prefer to, like, at least get it here and then play it back and hear it some kind of way. And I can select the kind of drum I want to use. But in this case, you're going to have to know what you're looking for. So I'm looking for something in here. And I'm going to find it. Hopefully, I'll find it. I'm looking for an 808. Here we go. Some 808 kick drums here. And we got one or two here. And these are crunches, right? It's a crunch. It's a crunch. Let's try this one. And now it's here under the sample here. Now the volume here you can see is 127. This volume is 71. This one is 81, right? So this is going to be louder than the rest. So uh, what I'll do here is I'll just play it. That's pretty big. Yeah. And I want to bring it down some, right? It's a little bit in the background just to be there. And you can hear it. And one of these is just too loud. So my thing, I'd prefer to like, if I could just hit this, and just play it. I can hear which drum it is and I know it's too loud. But what I need to do is probably just go down to here, I'll turn this off and then turn this off and get an idea. This is the one with too much crunch to it. I don't want that too much of a high into that one. And then I'll bring this one back up here. You have to come more on the bottom to it. And then I'll bring this one just a little bit behind it. I like that. That's a little stronger, a little more stronger. Let's play it from the top. So I can adjust that later on, but this is just a lesson on how we can layer drum sounds and get our own sound from several different sounds and sort of change the tuning, the pitch, and the volume, and we'll show you more also in the next lesson.